The fundamental purpose of the Demo 2 mission is to get certification for uh, uh, future uh, missions from uh, SpaceX to the International Space Station rotating crew uh, to meet NASA's needs on board the space station. Okay, so the major steps, I think the first major step is what we call the dry dress. So we'll go down there and do a, a few days before the launch, we'll do a dress rehearsal uh, once again, where we uh, go into the vehicle with our suits, interact with the vehicle and just make sure everything is ready to go. So on launch day, we'll have uh, that part of it all taken care of and we, we don't anticipate any problems at that point. And then there's launch day, uh, we will board the vehicle roughly three hours before launch, go through all those pre-flight checks, uh, and then ideally we won't scrub and we'll launch at 4.32 p.m. Eastern Standard Time on May 27th. And then uh, it's a, about a nine to 10 minute ride to orbit. And then it looks like uh, at least if we launch on the 27th, it's about a 15 hour rendezvous uh, to the space station. So. We'll go through the uh, on-orbit activities. Uh, we'll do some manual flying of the vehicle. We'll obviously sleep on the vehicle. Uh, and then we will continue through the rendezvous phase to where we end up in front of the space station uh, the next morning, uh, ready to dock. After uh, we spend uh, some time on board the International Space Station, obviously there'll be some checkouts that we'll do with the vehicle uh, while it is docked. And then uh, the undock will happen. We could spend anywhere from a few hours to a day or so on orbit before we uh, re-enter. And so we'll go through that whole process just to make sure it's what we expect and the vehicle performs the way it's supposed to. And then, uh, at the predetermined time, we'll do a deorbit burn, uh, which typically lasts uh, for Dragon around 10 minutes. And then the planned splashdown area is roughly uh, 25 to 30 miles off the coast of uh, Kennedy Space Center, uh, where the uh, SpaceX Ghost Searcher ship will be waiting for us to pick us up. I think that the, the mission that we have in front of us and the, the success that we're going to have is a representation of America. Um, bringing it back to the Florida coast is a, a, a really, really cool thing. To, just to see how many people from across the country have to pull together to, to pull something like this off is just a, it's inspiring to me and, and I'm just excited to be a part of it.